Hey folks, welcome to Sudden Impact Outdoors. Well, me and my cameraman Robert Russ has got right here. We got a gobbler roosted down on the end of this point. As you can see, we got just a little bit of a, a roll in a little pasture field right here. We're gonna get in here early in the morning, get us a decoy set up right here. They like to fly down, come up in here, do their strutting and their breeding right here in this little patch. So we're gonna try to intercept him right here in the morning. We're gonna get us a decoy out. We're gonna let him fly down. We're just gonna give him some clucks and purrs. And we're gonna see if we can get him come up here and we're gonna take his head off. So come join us in the morning. Sudden Impact Outdoors. that for live action. Hey, we are. Me and Robert, no hens, two gobblers, perfect setup. Wrong. We took off running and left our decoy. So we sat there and purred and clucked and he strutted and come all the way back down. Just turned away from us, dropped over the hill. So 
I've got a job meeting. I've got to be in Charleston at 10. We sat until 9. Got up. I was getting ready to shoot the ICAM Extreme tip of the week. Never leave your decoy. This bird hammers right across the hill. So we run up from the logging road we ran, set up our decoy, <coughs> back against the biggest tree we could find. <coughs> Made a couple of clucks and purrs and some yelps. Straight in he come. Robert gave me a range before he got here. 44 to that fence. It didn't look like he could see the decoy in the high grass. So he was just going across in front of us. So I suddenly impacted him. Here he is, folks. Looks like he's got good, heavy, sharp inch and a quarter spurs. Definitely a 10 inch beard. He's a good 19 pound gobbler. We got to run. We got to get out of here. I've got a meeting. You guys join us again on Sudden Impact Outdoors.